Hi all. So in this tutorial, we will see the second terminology that is XSD. The second terminology is uh, that we frequently used in web, so based web service that is XSD. So this XSD uh, is something that is related to Excel XML document. Okay, so this XSD is also called as XML schema or XML schema language or XML schema definition. Okay, so XSD stand for XML schema definition. So this XSD describes the structure of an XML document. Okay, so actually um, So, so, so actually, as as of now, what we understood is XML is basically used uh, of to exchange the data between the two applications in the SOAP based web service. So, so it XML is completely a tag based uh, language. There is no scope for define any rest data types like in XML we cannot define the data type of the tag right and also we cannot impose any validation of the data that will be there in the XML so there is no validations associated with the XML document so here comes the XSD so XSD is something that is actually defines the structure of an XML document. So all the validations, data type, what are the rules, what kind of data is valid within an XML. Some pattern, suppose some field is there in the tag is there in the XML and that element should have some pattern should be matched. Then only this XML should be valid. So all kind of validations imposed in the xml tag that we need to define in the xsd file so xsd file so xml document need to be connected with an xsd file so xml document has always have a reference to an xml schema or xsd file so this this these are the things that is mentioned in the slide like one of the greatest extent of xsd the support of the data type xsd is used to check a given xml document is valid and follows the rules laid out in the schema okay so visual document is also an xml document so that has also an associated xsd that so that what is valid to put in the xml document okay the purpose of an xml document is to define the legal building blocks of an xml document so so actually xsd file is defined the structure of an xml document okay so let's uh, take an example of this file to minimize this yeah, so this is one of the simple example of uh, XSD file. So we have seen that uh, the previous tutorial that one XML file having four uh, uh, tags within a root tag. So here I am just showing you the type of the each tag, each element we can say the tag of each element, data type of each element I am defining with this XSD file okay so yeah all the validation data types complex data type si simple data type all those informations any restrictions we want to pose all those things that we need to define in the xsd file okay so yeah this is all about uh, xsd thanks thanks for watching